Letters, 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 <laughs> letters. Live from the Doxinator's Gay Garage. It is time for letters for the uh, 7th of May, 2021. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Lisa K says, two thumbs up to Mr. Line Screw One. Bravo. Yes, he did a video where he was uh, defending me against the friendlies. I, I, I appreciate that, Mr. Andy. Thank you so much. And you've got to check out the new uh, Vlogger Puppets video. <laughs> what is that noise? What is that noise? I don't know. I think it's the lawn boy. Uh, tiny house here. I, you know, the, again, the names are all truncated on the phone here. The tiny house something or other. You crack me up. Army of friendlies. Here's my thought as a critic. You will get criticized too. Shrug. All the more entertaining. You don't like it either. My mom always said not everyone is going to like you. Let stuff roll off your back. Best way is to, to lose a narcissist like Line Screw is to be boring to him. No a reaction and he will eventually st he'll stop eventually anyway. You know, again, I think, you know, Line Screw takes criticism very well. I think I take criticism very well. You know, it's not always fun to get criticized, but, you know, it's part of being a public persona. You know what I'm saying? I don't get angry about it. I laugh at it. You know, I get a lot of kooky stuff said about me, and I just kind of go, ha, 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 and, and Andy does, too. Like Mr. At Line Screw does, too. But, you know, we don't, we don't have armies of, uh, armies of friendlies. Oh, yeah. Carolyn's RV Life is right, writes, uh, who's this, Cindy? Cindy, Carolyn's RV Life is right. Uh, yeah, she is 100% right. When women stand up for themselves, people attack them. You keep defending the shady mechanic that tried to rip her off. Why? I don't defend the shady mechanic. You come out here. Oh, it's... Uh. Uh, you know, I'm not defending the shady mechanic. I am defending, you know, I'm telling her that there are certain ways to handle the shady mechanic rather than just make the shady mechanic, you know. And if it is a shady mechanic, it's, you know, I mean, you know, you're assuming that, right? I mean, I don't know. But, uh, you know, you got to learn to, you know, you're, everybody's going to get ripped off from time to time, but you can't let it get you like totally uh, angry about it and all that stuff. And you got to take, you know, find ways to reduce getting ripped off. And one of those ways is, you know, dealing with people civilly. And then if you get bad treatment, you just don't ever go back. SC1212 Abel says she, gee, I wonder who that is. Can't be that bad. She did donate her used socks she wore on the, the motel hike to the, of the PCT. No, no, they weren't used socks, okay? They were new socks, okay? Come on. Usually when one hikes the PCT at the end of their journey, they look very fit and thin. So, yeah, I'm not going any further with that one. <laughs> Congratulations, Tracy, writes Sunny Girl. Yeah, we reported this morning a special bulletin on the Akimotive channel that Trip and Tracy's gotten tied the knot. She got married. Again. <laughs> Brian Garrow says some people really enjoy the feeling that comes from being a nomad. Best wishes to the new couple. Chi Chi McGee says Tracy did a video a few months back discussing her four ex husbands. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Rick Petticord, the lengths some folks will go to to uh, avoid a lunch date with Camo Dave are quite elaborate. <laughs> Everybody says, I'm coming to North Carolina. Oh, wait, oh, wait. I can't talk to, I don't want to talk to Camo Dave. I'll have to drive around. Yeah, we had that one particular nomad that actually drove all the way around the state. He, You go up the East Coast and you completely avoid North Carolina. You can do that. Florida, Georgia, then around to Tennessee and Virginia. You can completely ski, skip around North Carolina. And uh, we actually have some nomads that do that. <laughs> Pizza, earth, pancakes, and et cetera, et cetera. Uh, they also have just married honeymoon drones, so they don't give each other the plague on their special occasion. Oh, right. Mr. Rockford writes, con James Rockford writes, congratulations to Trip and Tracy and to her new future ex-husband. Oh, come on. The, number five may be the charm. It very well may be. 
Janine writes, YouTubers are so petty. I'm tired of all this infighting BS. So am I. Evan says, fire the doxy. He's, he's like Kramer. He doesn't really work there. <laughs> it didn't make any sense, did it? You should have read my comment yesterday. Which comment? The one where I said, um, Sven Gulli's movie Saturday Night, Attack of the 50-Foot Friendly. <laughs> aku, a, a, aku, something like that. You call yourself a critical channel. Is that the same thing as a reaction channel? YouTube doesn't seem to have a problem with reaction channels because there's a lot more of them. Yeah, I don't know, man. All I know is that if you put some... Uh, if you use someone else's video and they don't like you, they can come back and file strikes against you. That's all I do. You know, that's all I know. Tires, 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 says Ray. <laughs> what? Uh, e, again, I can't read all these names because they're truncated on my phone. Don't sweat the petty stuff and don't get the sweaty stuff. And don't, wait, don't sweat the petty stuff and don't pet the sweaty stuff. That's good Good advice. Tex Texaco says, I heard that the friendlies and the weirdos are having a meeting at the clubhouse tonight. <laughs> Doxy, uh, Warren says, Doxy kind of reminds me of that lovable actor, Leo G. Carroll, in the old TV program, Topper. He also was in The Tarantula. Yeah. He was also in The Man from Uncle. Yeah. Remember that old show? Yeah. He was kind of ugly. I don't appreciate. Yeah, he wasn't. He wasn't ugly. He was. Yeah, he, he was. was. You know, well. He looked like a horror person. <laughs> Meowich must have been in Springfield, Virginia. I passed by your old stomping ground, the shopping center that has the BGR and the burger joint. Thought of you. I find that oddly strange. See the impact you have on people. Oh yeah. Mark from Arizona says, "Fire the doxinator." It's his channel, Camo Dave Works for the Doxinator, LOL. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and finally, Pedro, love you, Dave, but you are an S-stirrer. Ah! All right, everybody, live from the Gay Garage here at beautiful Doxy Central. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Anyway, look at this place. Wow. Uh, we'll give you a tour of this place very soon. All right, folks, thanks for watching. Vlog under!